How was the ancient city of Pompeii destroyed? In 1748, the royal engineer of the King of Naples, Alcubierre, was ordered to inspect an aqueduct that had been built about 150 years earlier. He began excavations about 20 kilometers northwest of Naples and unexpectedly discovered the long-lost ancient Roman city of Pompeii, which had a history of over 1,600 years. Since 1860, through more than a century of systematic and large-scale excavations, the ancient city of Pompeii has been largely revealed to the world. The excavations uncovered facilities such as an amphitheater, stadium, hotels, casinos, brothels, and public baths, showcasing it as a place of entertainment for the upper echelons of the Roman Empire. However, mysteries remain, particularly regarding the tragic deaths of those who stayed in the city and the unknown whereabouts of most of its inhabitants. It is widely believed that Pompeii's destruction was due to the eruption of Mount Vesuvius. On August 24, 79 AD, at noon, Mount Vesuvius erupted, covering the entire city of Pompeii with hot volcanic ash in a matter of hours. This vibrant ancient city was instantly buried, disappearing into the dust of history. The destruction of the ancient city of Pompeii by the eruption of Mount Vesuvius is largely undisputed. Some opinions suggest that the city was not submerged in volcanic ash within a few hours. The eruption of Mount Vesuvius lasted for eight days and nights, with the city's inhabitants suffering multiple ash falls. The first wave of the attack was relatively slow and caused almost no casualties. 48 hours later, when the volcanic emissions decreased and the sky began to clear, many residents who had fled the city believed the danger had passed and returned. However, it was at this time that a second, more violent eruption occurred, leaving behind the remnants we see today. The ash rain continued for eight days and nights, and as the steam cooled, it condensed into droplets, forming a torrential rain with the ash in the air. The heavy rain washed the ash down from the mountaintop, creating mud flows. These mud flows, once dried, became as hard as stone, sealing cities like Pompeii and allowing later generations to see a well-preserved city museum. The excavation of Pompeii allows us to walk into a dream, as if traveling back in time to the cities of the Roman Empire in the first century AD. However, one mystery still puzzles people. Geographically, Naples, the fourth largest city in Italy, is situated slightly higher than Pompeii was at the time. During the eruption of Mount Vesuvius, the prevailing winds were from the northwest, while the opening of the volcano was to the northeast. Why then did the volcanic ash not affect Naples? This has led to a profound sense of loss over the disappearance of the once flourishing ancient city of Pompeii.